All right, well, here we are back in our printing room right now. And so if you've watched the first video, you have successfully saved your image onto a PDF and submitted it into Google Classroom. At this stage, your teacher will be sitting here when it is time to print and print off your sheet along with a whole bunch of other students' projects. And it's gonna be your job to locate your logo or your die sub project and then cut it out with a pair of scissors, okay? I've already done that right here. And so some key things for cutting this out, you wanna leave some white around your graphic so that you can successfully tape this on to your tag or your mug or whatever it is with this heat tape. Don't just use any random tape that you see around here. Okay, so I'm going to position my cardinal head on my tag here like that. Okay, this stage, I would wrap that around and then put tape on the back. If any tape were to cross over into this actual image right here, okay, it's going to um, deflect that heat and it won't actually die sublimate onto that tag, okay? And I've actually done that with this tag here. If we look really close, I've got my tag. I got a little bit of the tail of the cardinal that's gonna come off. That's just my poor design phase right there. But you can see none of my heat tape is gonna transfer onto what I actually want to die sublimate. Okay, if you look really closely, you can see the cardinal head through there through the white paper. Okay, but this is the stage where you want to start to prep your substrate so that you can die sublimate your graphic from the paper onto that substrate, be that a dog tag, luggage tag, mug, ball cap, whatever it is, okay? So after this stage, we're gonna head to the iron.